Welcome to our journey through the annals of Byzantine history, where we unravel the legacies of the emperors who once reigned over the illustrious Eastern Roman Empire. Spanning over a thousand years from the establishment of Constantinople in 330 AD to the fall of the city in 1453, the Byzantine Empire was a beacon of culture, power, and resilience. In this video, we will rank some famous Byzantine emperors from the most ineffective to the most glorious of them, exploring their triumphs and failures, their contributions to the empire, and their roles in its decline. From the visionary leaders who expanded the empire's borders and enriched its cultural heritage, to the despots whose reigns were marred by corruption and incompetence, each emperor left an indelible mark on history. Whether they were revered as heroes or reviled as tyrants, these emperors navigated a complex and ever-changing world, striving to maintain the empire's legacy amidst constant challenges. Emperor Andronikos, who ruled from 1183 to 1185 AD, occupies a dark chapter in Byzantine history, characterized by tyranny and cruelty. Born into the prestigious Komnenos dynasty, Andronikos' reign was marked by a ruthless pursuit of power and a penchant for violence. He ascended to the throne amidst the political turmoil of the late 12th century Byzantine Empire, and his reign quickly descended into a reign of terror. Andronikos' rule was characterized by a series of brutal purges and executions, targeting both real and perceived enemies within the imperial court and beyond. His despotic methods instilled widespread fear and resentment among the Byzantine aristocracy and the general populace, leading to a climate of instability and unrest. Ultimately, Andronikos' tyrannical regime led to his violent overthrow in 1185, marking the end of his brief and infamous reign and serving as a cautionary tale of the dangers of unchecked power in Byzantine politics. Emperor Phocas, who ruled from 602 to 610 AD, is often remembered as one of the most ineffective Byzantine emperors. His rise to power was marked by a violent coup that overthrew Emperor Maurice resulting in the brutal purge of Maurice's supporters and family. Focus's reign was characterized by internal strife and widespread brutality, leading to significant discontent among the populace and the aristocracy. His oppressive measures and harsh policies caused widespread political instability and undermined the administrative structure of the Byzantine state. During his reign, the empire faced severe external threats most notably from the Persian Empire, which launched a series of devastating invasions. These invasions further destabilized the region and led to significant territorial losses for the Byzantines. Focus's inability to effectively manage both internal revolts and external threats ultimately led to his downfall. In 610 AD, Heraclius, the exarch of Africa, launched a successful revolt overthrowing Phocas and taking the throne. Phocas was captured and executed, marking a violent end to his turbulent rule. Basil II, known as Basil the Bulgar Slayer, reigned from 976 to 1025 AD and is celebrated as one of the greatest Byzantine emperors. His reign was marked by military prowess, administrative efficiency, and territorial expansion. Basil II's most famous achievement was his relentless campaign against the Bulgarian Empire, culminating in the decisive Battle of Clivian in 1014 AD, significantly expanding Byzantine control in the Balkans. Basil II was also an astute administrator, strengthening the empire's finances through effective tax policies and reducing the power of the wealthy landowning class. His reign saw the consolidation of imperial authority and the enhancement of central control. Under Basil II, the Byzantine Empire reached its peak in territorial extent and military might. His strategic vision and relentless pursuit of power ensured the empire's dominance in the medieval world, cementing his legacy as one of the greatest Byzantine emperors. 
Emperor Heraclius is renowned for his transformative and resilient leadership during one of the most tumultuous periods in Byzantine history. Taking the throne amid political chaos and external threats, Heraclius revitalized the empire through comprehensive military and administrative reforms. His most notable achievement was the dramatic and strategic counteroffensive against the Persian Empire, culminating in the decisive Battle of Nineveh in 627 AD, which effectively ended the protracted Byzantine-Sasanian War and restored much of the lost territory. Heraclius also restructured the empire's military by establishing the Thematis system, which decentralized command and improved local defense capabilities, laying the groundwork for the Byzantine military's resilience in the centuries to come. His reign saw the recovery of the True Cross, a significant religious and moral victory that bolstered his standing among his people. Despite facing the emerging threat of Arab invasions toward the end of his reign, Heraclius's strategic acumen and reforms stabilized the empire during a critical era. Emperor Constantine VII is remembered for his contributions to Byzantine culture and administration. Though his early reign was overshadowed by regents and co-emperors, Constantine VII eventually asserted his authority and became a significant cultural and intellectual figure. His most notable achievements lie in his scholarly works and patronage of the arts. Constantine VII authored and commissioned numerous texts, including the De Administrando Imperio, which offered valuable insights into the governance and foreign policy of the empire, and De Ceremonius, detailing court rituals and protocols. These works have provided historians with a wealth of information about Byzantine statecraft and society. Under his rule, the Macedonian Renaissance flourished, marked by a revival of classical learning and the arts. Constantine VII's emphasis on education and cultural patronage strengthened the intellectual foundation of the Byzantine Empire. Justinian I, known as Justinian the Great, reigned from 527 to 565 AD and is celebrated as one of the most illustrious Byzantine emperors. His reign was marked by sweeping reforms, monumental construction projects, and military conquests. Justinian's most notable achievement, the Corpus Juris Civilis, or Justinian Code, was a comprehensive codification of Roman law that has profoundly influenced modern legal systems, unifying and preserving Roman legal thought for future generations. Justinian's architectural legacy is highlighted by the Hagia Sophia, completed in 537 AD, which stands as a testament to his grand vision and innovation. His military campaigns, led by General Belisarius, reclaimed significant territories in North Africa, Italy and parts of Spain, temporarily restoring much of the Western Roman Empire. Despite facing challenges such as the devastating plague of 541, 542 and ongoing wars, Justinian's reign marked a high point in Byzantine history, characterized by cultural renaissance, legal reform and territorial expansion.